Michael, thank you so much for being with us. It's great to have you. It's great to be here. Thanks for having me. Of course. So, Michael, before we get into uh, the baby bonus, tell our viewers who don't already know what Public Square is all about, a little bit more about the company and what you guys are working to accomplish. Well, we are the nation's largest marketplace of businesses that are pro-life, pro-family, and pro-freedom. We ultimately believe that America's economy is under attack by globalists who desire to sell out our country and the values that made it special. And we believe the best way that we can actually push back against that attack and secure a prosperous future for the United States is with the power of commerce. If millions of consumers will shop their values with the power of their wallet, we believe that ultimately we can shift the power structures of society back toward the values of we, the people. So we started a digital marketplace that helps consumers do just that. We have over 1.1 million consumer accounts on the platform, shopping from over 55,000 different business vendors of all different industries that are rallied around a similar cause, which is supporting the Constitution and the values that made this country special in the first place. You can find us at publicsq.com. That is just so awesome. I think creating and supporting a parallel economy, so to speak, is, is just really the solution to so much of the insanity that we're seeing unfold every single day. So I just love what you guys are doing. Now, Michael, I know you just announced that you're now offering employees the $5,000 bonus if they have a baby or adopt, and this is just so fantastic. I don't think I've ever heard of any such thing before. Can you tell us what motivated you to want to implement this at Public Square? Well, you said it at the outset, actually. The fact that these major corporate entities in the United States that are run with very anti-family values are in the name of women's health care funding their employees abortions when we obviously know that they're doing this because they're afraid of losing productivity productivity and they just want to protect their bottom line there's such an anti-family sentiment into in society because of actions like this and we're wanting to sing an opposite tune we actually believe that our company is only as strong as the families that have built it and if we want to actually secure a healthy and productive company for the long haul that looks like empowering our team members to feel like this is a safe place and an exciting office community where they can actually grow their families and know that that's celebrated by their employer, not criticized. And so we actually wanted to put our money where our mouth is. We're a pro-family company. We thought, let's actually go ahead and do a $5,000 bonus after taxes for any of our employees that were to have a baby or to adopt. And uh, that's very different than the $4,500 that Lululemon and Airbnb and Nike and these different companies are spending to incentivize abortion. So it's working. We've had employees take us up on this. We mm -hmm. actually had a team member that had a baby just this morning. Wow. And so we were proud to pay out that baby bonus. Yep. Oh, that is so wonderful. I was just going to ask, have any employees taken advantage of this yet? But I guess the next question is, have you had any new people come on board uh, now knowing that you're offering this incentive? It's pretty exciting. We actually, just since we announced this about two weeks ago, have hired another nine people. We're wow. a fast growing tech company. We're one of the fastest growing companies in the United States right now. And we actually hit a million member accounts faster than Twitter did in their early days. And so we really think that the uh, the sky is blue for Public Square. We believe that ultimately uh, the highway is laid out. It's on us to execute, but that only works if we have great, happy, healthy team members. And uh, the fact that this message is resonating with our employees is a big win because it showcases, uh, it's a positive mark of their character, that they're excited about family values is a good sign that we hired the right people. Yeah, absolutely. That's so true. I, I follow so many influencers that promote Public Square, and I just love what you guys are doing. And I, I just could tell this wave of joy that overcame social media the day you announced this. People are just proud of it, and I love to see that. It's so important. And it's so important to protect the family unit and celebrate the sanctity of life. Um, so I'm so glad you guys are so boldly standing for all of the traditional American values that made our country so great. Michael, why do you think so many businesses are turning away from the very principles that made our nation what it is today? I think it's one of two reasons. The first is that they actually genuinely ideologically hate our country. They hate the values that built it. And at the end of the day, they see the family unit, a strong family unit as a threat to their power because they want to create a dependency state. They don't want you to be self-sustaining and prioritizing the value of your own family unit in your local community. They instead want to create this sort of global dependency class. For all our viewers asking where One America News is heading in the future, we would like to introduce you to OAN Live. OAN Live is the best way to stay up to date on all of the hard-hitting, straight-shooting, national and international headlines. And the best part is, OAN Live is only $4.99 per month. All the credible, honest, unbiased reporting One America News offers at a fraction of the cost of cable. Just go to OANN.com to easily sign up for OAN Live and stay informed.